Be wary of the high-protein, low-carbohydrate diet. Be careful if your diet consists mostly of protein and fat and restricts carbohydrates. Protein is more efficient than fat or carbs in keeping us full, but eating too much of it may have serious health consequences. If you're allowed protein, you won't feel as starved and will be more inclined to follow your diet plan. Bad breath, gastrointestinal issues, and even renal disease are just some of the negative impacts that may result from eating too much protein. There are safer methods of weight loss that won't jeopardize your health. While protein is essential, it shouldn't make up the bulk of your daily calorie intake. We rely on the necessary amino acids it generates for tissue repair and for participation in metabolic processes. To put it simply, it aids in maintaining our vigilance. You may find it in anything from beef to cheese. A high-fiber breakfast should be the first meal of the day. You may feel the need to gorge on carbs after a night of low energy consumption. Constipation, which can make your stomach feel full, can be helped by eating more fiber, which also speeds up digestion, gives you energy, and keeps your bowel movements regular. You need to eat protein and enough of it. Get some good cuts of meat and trim off the excess fat. Fresh fish and low-fat dairy items like skim milk and cottage cheese should be staples in your diet. Beans have a lot of positive nutritional qualities, including high protein, low fat, and high fiber content. They aid in maintaining satiety for a longer period of time. However, some individuals have severe side effects while taking them, so it may be best to raise your dosage slowly at first. Increasing your intake of legumes might be the key to living a long and healthy life. They've been shown to be effective in the battle against sickness, especially breast cancer. Spreading your daily protein intake out across many meals is preferable to eating all of it at once. People in the West tend to consume the majority of their daily protein intake during dinner time. Eating your daily allotment of protein first thing in the morning can help you feel more alert and productive since it delivers critical amino acids that the brain needs to operate correctly. If you want your meals to provide a steady stream of energy, add some protein to each one. Eating less, but more often, may also speed up your metabolism and aid in weight loss. Add some heat to your diet, chilies are another metabolic booster. Caffeine should be avoided at all costs while beginning a low-carb diet. Too much coffee has obvious negative effects, but did you realize it may also lead to weight gain? We need to maintain insulin levels low to restrict fat formation, and caffeine has been shown to have an adverse effect on insulin production. Eliminating our daily coffee habits can help us save money, cut down on calories, and maintain healthy insulin levels. In the end, you'll be able to shed pounds in a healthy way.